Hey Taurus, uh, what's up? This is Soul, Intuitive uh, Tarot for Unique Souls. Welcome to my channel. Taurus, this is going to be your general weekly focus reading for the week of uh, March 21st through the 27th, 2016. Uh, before I begin your reading, Taurus, uh, please keep in mind the messages that come forth will resonate with some of you, but not all of you. The energy that I feel <clears throat> and I see coming forth uh, for some bulls this upcoming week is related to the six of cups in the reverse six of cups in the reverse uh the message that i'm getting there's a couple messages here relate to overcoming some sort of uh disappointment emotional disappointment related to uh because this is a general reading you have to you know take the messages that i give you and apply it to whatever is close or significant to you so this could be uh you know, a childhood friend, uh, a relationship. Uh, some Tauruses I'm reading for are dating or possibly in a relationship with a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces, male or female. There may be a potential of something in terms of that uh, relationship that may upset you this uh, upcoming week. Or it could be the if it is the water sign that I'm sensing that some Tauruses are dealing with, it could be that the water sign uh, person becomes emotionally uh, upset or disappointed. This is only attached to um, I'm, getting, I'm getting a relationship. OK, also because this is the, your central energy and your theme for the week is overcoming some sort of emotional disappointment. Um, attached to possibly someone who may have tried to return. This return that I'm getting is related to someone from your past involving an intimate or romantic relationship. And either it didn't go well or there was some sort of uh, short expectation. Something didn't go right in terms of meeting someone who possibly wanted to reconnect with a Taurus uh, and it's right now I'm sensing that the connection didn't go well. And this could be a distant uh, friend or relative as well. Uh, so I do want to attach that. But because it is the Six of Cups, it's related to love and emotions. I'm just sensing that someone from your past, possibly a water sign again, Cancer, Scorpio or Pisces, uh, may have tried to reach out to you, reconnect with you. And it didn't go well someone was upset with that situation okay that's the message but it's overcoming some sort of emotional disappointment in terms of some attachment relationship friendship there also could be an overcoming of some Tauruses possibly Going back in the past, thinking, you know, going down memory lane or something like that related to the Six of Cups in the reverse. So it's overcoming what I just said is the central energy and disappointments. If you're attached or dating a water sign, there's the potential of that person becoming upset emotionally. Uh, it doesn't necessarily have to be directed towards you. It could be that they're just dealing with some emotional stuff and... it may have some sort of a impact or effect on you. So just keep that in mind. Recent past. Okay, now here we go. Recent past, yesterday going back to two weeks. We have the Two of Cups in the reverse. Now the Two of Cups is uh, in the reverse and I don't really like the Two of Cups in the reverse because I'm getting a message that, again, related to the Six of Cups and what I said about someone possibly trying to reconnect or reestablish themselves with you, or it could have been you trying to reconnect with someone from your distant past. Now, in the recent past, this Two of Cups shows up that, what I said, some sort of emotional disappointment or upsets related to an attachment or relationship. And then I'm also getting that for some Tauruses involved in the relationship, the, the partner, the person that they're dating, Another water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces possibly aren't on the same page 
aren't seeing eye to eye. There's some differences between the two. And I like it because it's in the, uh, excuse me, the passing phase. So I feel that you just experience, some Taurus has experienced some sort of uh, disappointment related to a relationship. I don't know why. I'm going to stick with that. And it's related to a uh, water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces, male or female. And I just feel that the overall energy relates to Taurus is not seeing eye to eye on the same page with their dating partner or someone they're in the, a relationship with. Possibly parting of the ways with the Two of Cups that's showing up in the uh, reverse. When it's in the upright, which, excuse me, which I like to see is that two people are coming together. Everyone is on the same page, seeing eye to eye and mutual love, affection and attraction between the two. But something not necessarily disturbing, but something emotionally happened uh, related to couples in the past two weeks. Yesterday, going back to the past two weeks. All right. So in the middle of the week, we have the page of swords in the uh, upright. So. For some Tauruses this week, you have to deal with something coming in quick. Uh, the something that comes in quick relates to the message that I'm hearing in terms of a decision. Uh, there's a decision that a Taurus has to make, or some Tauruses have to make, and it may take place in the middle of the week. This also puts the Tauruses that I'm feeling in a defensive mode. Uh, either someone tries to launch an attack on you or you're launching an attack on them. So you're in defense mode. OK, uh, this is related to air sign energies, uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, male or female. So just be mindful of this. Something comes in quick, but there's a lot of determination with this uh, page of swords that shows up in the middle of the week. Uh, once that situation occurs then there's this swiftness of taking action and it may uh, either land you in a defense mode or the person who's coming after you in a defense mode so just be mindful and careful of that energy but it comes in quick okay all right so the tail end of your reading uh taurus uh for some tauruses this week uh, we did we have a major arcana major life event the hermit is in the upright this is not really a bad card. I like this because I feel that some uh, bulls are going to take some time out going into the weekend. Maybe this is um, time for you to take a step back, uh, do some sort of assessment, evaluation. Uh, if it's related to a relationship, that's fine. But the messages that have come uh, forth uh, also extend out to uh, having to take a step back or disconnect from people in general just to uh evaluate where you are uh, currently or what your it's like what your next step is going to be in terms of moving forward I don't see the hermit as a negative uh, card or you know energy it's just that some of you are wanting to some of you are anticipating a weekend so that you can deal with having to spend some sort of uh, solitary time alone disconnecting from people temporarily uh and i don't like to say going into a dark phase no it's just you're taking time out for self detaching from family friends relationships uh, it's only temporary and just to evaluate where your current life situation is where you would like to move forward and then you will come out of the light or you'll step into the light afterwards uh, so it's sort of like a refreshing uh, thing that you need to do some Tauruses need to do okay it's like a pulling back but it's only temporary so it's good energy still the energy of Oracle card that I have selected for you Taurus is victory so whatever happens this week and related to either you being defensive or someone being defensive uh, towards you and this uh, whole uh, energy of the relationship aspects uh, you some Tauruses will achieve victory so you have to apply it to whatever is close or significant to you. So there is some sort of victory coming uh, 
your way, the Taurus's way, this uh, particular week. So it may be a goal that you have set, and now you're that goal that you have set in the recent past is coming to fruition. It may be a relationship that you were uh, trying to establish and you achieve some sort of victory uh, with that. Anything, anything involving success and victory. And then I do see a lot of, uh, not really a lot, but a lot of, I should say some sort of celebration. I'm sorry, I apologize for getting tongue-tied. I do see celebration with this victory. So something good coming in for some Tauruses this week. Uh, so you guys who comment a lot, and I really do appreciate your comments, you have to chime in and let me know what happens with this uh, victory card that I pulled for for you. All right, so this is your reading, Taurus. Um, once again, I want to thank you for visiting my channel. Uh, I do want to wish you all a very safe upcoming week ahead. Until the next time, I wish you all love and light. Take care. Bye.